Good morning, it's James. It is really good to see you today. Thank you for your time. Thank you for energy. I'm deeply grateful to have the honor and the blessing of laying eyes on you. And I do hope and pray that this message finds you and all the people that you love peaceful, thriving, and very, very well. So today's message, I believe, is going to help all of us feel a sense of belonging. I can think of a thousand times, if not more, when I was looking at life through the lens of fitting in, knowing that me wanting to be a part of something was going to ask for me to compromise a value, a way in which I perceive life, the way I wanted to show up for myself, my authenticity, and ultimately my vulnerability. Fitting in had cost me so many times in my life my true peace of mind. I want to share with you something that I was journaling about this morning that I think for all of us, as you think about times in your life, when you were looking to belong or wanting to feel a sense of belonging, instead you chose to fit in and only every time it leaves us feeling empty and looking for more. So uh, Brene Brown wrote a beautiful quote that really speaks to this. Belonging doesn't require us to change who we are. It requires us to be who we are. Requires us to be who we are. I came across this quote recently by Brene Brown in her book, The Gifts of Imperfection. And I believe it sums up perfectly a challenge in life that we so often encounter. When she said fitting in is about assessing situation, like looking around our life, looking around a group, looking around the present environment and going, huh, this is what's going to take for me to fit in. What do I need to change about myself? What do I need to let go? Where do I need to really, um, how should we say, diminish my authenticity and the truth of who I am and what I value in order to fit into this situation, this group, this community? And instead, she said, becoming who you are, you need to be accepted. That's what we'll do to fit in. Belonging, on the other hand, doesn't require us to change who we are. It absolutely requires us to be who we are. I think that this is a time in life where a lot of us are looking around our groups, our communities, the places that we may spend on social media. And if we really do ask ourselves those really deep questions like, when I'm here, when I'm doing this par partaking in the community, do I feel like I belong? Or am I challenging myself and letting go of parts of myself in order to fit in? I think in my life, the more important things that I've looked at in my life is when, even when I had to go it alone, I felt belonging. I felt belonging to God. I felt belonging to my soul. I felt connected to my truth. And ultimately, I felt peace, even when I was alone, because belonging to those pieces are the most important thing in my life. I would love for you to think about today where you might be trying to fit in or even more importantly, where you don't fit in any longer. And what are you willing to do to let go of fitting in in order to give yourself permission to belong? Belonging is healing. Belonging is becoming. Belonging is home. I think when I find myself in a space of belonging, you may feel this too, you feel that you can fully surrender, that you don't have to find ways to escape yourself in order to fit in, you actually choose a belonging and then you feel like you're home. You give yourself permission to feel like you're home. I really wanted this treehouse experience to be a place where belonging could happen, where all types of walks and fates and orientations could feel welcome and feel like they belong. I think vulnerability is one of the most beautiful ways that we help ourselves to feel belonging. It's the one way in which we give ourselves permission to express our humanity, our common humanness, and all the things that come along with that, the beautiful imperfections as well as the spiritual perfection, an opportunity to fully give ourselves permission to outgrow the need to fit in and fully surrender to the feeling of belonging and coming home. Thank you for giving me the feeling of belonging here Yes, this is my treehouse, but it's the community, it's you, that gives me the permission to feel like I belong. Sending you much love and many blessings. I wish you all the things that make you feel a sense of belonging and make you come home. Bye for now.